I'm responsible for a water treatment plant. Today, I'm managing all of my operations through the operator's workstation using InTouch. It's a great tool for operators, but it really doesn't give me the information I need to understand the operational problems I have. I've been challenged to reduce my cost, and that really translates to energy and maintenance. Today, I'm replacing pumps twice a year that I know are rated to last much longer, so I suspect this has something to do with their duty cycle. I'm too busy fighting fires to have time to develop something around in touch. I really need something that's super simple that just gives me the information I need. So I've decided to give Wonderware Online a try. It's really easy to get started. I download this free Historian Publisher and I can register my InTouch application with Wonderware Online. Really simple. Then I can go back to my office and go to the website and log in. If I don't really know the details of the application, I just have to have a general idea. In this case, I know I've got a manifold that has several pumps. So if I just type manifold, I automatically find the pumps that I'm interested in. And I can see here what the flow rates on these pumps has been. Now it's starting to look like I understand the problem. The flow rate's changing an awful lot. That suggests that it really is the duty cycle. So I can look at the actual pump status and see that more details here. Ah, there's my problem. This pump coming off and on every 30 seconds. Another one's coming on and off every minute. Here I can see details, how much the average runtime is for each pump. You can tell that one of them, the blue one, is on all the time. Now I know what to do. I'm going to go make some changes at the control system layer and see if I can improve this operation. Now I've fixed my problem, or at least I think I have. It's been a few hours since I finished those changes, so I come back to my desk and again pull up this information. Now you can see that the same pumps are not oscillating back and forth. Now they're running much more consistently. there's a lot more even distribution of the running state. I can also look at energy usage, and I'll find that that's also lower. Here you can see the starts and stops really increase my energy usage. Now that I've improved that control, it's much more efficient. This is also going to make my pumps last longer, but I don't want to have to be at my desk to check up on this. So I'm going to send this report to my mobile device. Give it a name. And share it. Now if I switch over to my phone, I can start Smart Glance. And here's a report I just created. I can select some tags and get a chart in a couple of different formats. Find exact values at a particular point in time. And set up an alert so when the level gets above a particular limit, 60, I'll be notified. It's all that simple. 